Hi, this is Dr. Don. I want to take a few minutes and show you how to create a chart that uses data from two different worksheets. And we'll create the chart first from one of the worksheets and then we'll show you how to add the data from the other worksheet. But it could be adding the data from any place on any worksheet. So let's get started. The first thing I want to do is select the data and create the basic chart. Now we're going to use these first three columns here. The first is the month year, and that will be my x-axis, so that's why that's the leftmost column. And then we're going to pick up the actual sales column, and then the k equal 3, moving average k equal 3 column. So let's just click there, drag over to get those three, and then drag down to the very bottom to get the data plus that last month's forecast. And then I can just go to Insert, Recommended Charts, and I'm going to show you go to All Charts here, because that is the line chart there, but they'll give you the chance to check whatever kind of chart you want. I want that one, so I'm going to click OK. And then I'm going to Control X and move this up toward the top where I can see things over there. So there's my basic chart. We want to edit it to include the axis title. So over here, just make sure the chart selected like I have there anywhere on the chart. Click, click on the plus to add elements. We want the axis titles there. And we've got the trend already there. I'm going to get rid of the grid lines. I don't want those. So it's just a nice clean chart. And the first thing I want to do is to put the title in. So I'm going to click on that to select it go up here and put my cursor in the formula bar, enter an equal, and then I can click on the cell that I want to use for my title and then hit enter and it will change here. Do the same thing for the uh, access title. I'll show you that one. Click on it, go up to your formula bar, equal, and then put uh, the, uh, see, we want this is the month year, enter. And so that's how you would label these, and you will go ahead and do the same thing for the axis title there. To add another data set, uh, we're going to click anywhere in the chart itself, interior of the chart. You can see there's our data. And of course, the data you're adding, if we're going to use the same axes, needs to be formatted the same way with the month, year, and then the sales. Like the, just the inside, Click on select data, got to do that. And then we're going to go here and you can see we want to add data in the series name. We'll go here to this one is going to be K equal nine. And then down here, I want to clear this out. And there's where I actually select the forecast. And hit OK. And click OK. Now you can see we've got our basic chart there with it labeled uh, properly the x axis and the, uh, the x axis and the y axis, the title, and then actual sales. And that's your basic chart. That's how to add an additional data set from a different worksheet onto an existing chart. Hope this helps.